What is up my little sugar bugs? Welcome back to the channel for a brand new CC shopping haul. So today you guys, we are going to be going through the finds I found for children and toddlers. This video has been requested so many times I can barely keep count, but it was requested in the nick of time because we have just started up the 100 baby challenge and I'm so freaking excited because Penelope and Phoenix are going to need a makeover in the very next episode and now we have so many things to choose from. Now in this haul alone I will be showcasing upwards of 273 items and in four days we will have an adult CZ shopping haul so you guys we got a lot of hauls coming up I hope that you're ready I hope that you that your computer can handle it because I swear this is the dilemma that we go through every second every wait what bitch where um every single freaking time okay so we're gonna start off with the hairs as you guys can see I have a lot now I would love you know let's just pick a color that's kind of like dark and kind of light so you can get a general idea I would love to go through all of the swatches if I could um, but unfortunately because there is just so much to share with you it's literally impossible to like go through all the swatches stumbling out of bed and I still got you in my head from all those pretty words you said it's like I'm wasted every time I see your face I'm losing track of time and space I don't know where I am it's like I'm wasted and I won't waste it And I promise that I I will stand by you forever I can't get you out of my mind I will follow you wherever And I won't waste it Slow this down, my heart is screaming out your name, I'm wasted on you. Here we are, right underneath the stars, so let's get a little reckless. You make me breathless, and I won't waste this. And I promise that I... said I I will stand by you forever and I won't waste it Okay, so that's it for all of the female hairs. I do have a couple hats. I've got some flower accessories for one of the other hairs, which I'm not going to like show. I'm not going to get like caught up on the, the finer things, you know what I mean? Because we have so much to go through. But this hat here, I think is just like a recolor possibly. I'm not 100% sure. Um, but I really thought it was absolutely adorable and it looks great. So I found this little sweater and I think it is seriously adorable. My interpretation of this sweater is probably this toddler borrowing maybe their older sister or brother sweatshirt because they're cold I just I think it's so cute and the thing about this too is if you wanted to you could also go and pair it with some really cute leggings like for instance these sparkly ones that I found they are super gorgeous and if you really wanted to like amp it up a little bit more you could throw on like these little um these little 
what is it called knee high socks if you wanted i also have these ones here with the lace which i mean that color doesn't look too good but you can play around and i also found these really cute kind of folded up socks i don't know if you'll be able to see that but they do tie into the leggings unfortunately but i actually like that i think that works in our in our favor here so i really loved that sweatshirt at first i wasn't going to download it but i had to have it it is just absolutely adorable i got this full body outfit here which is super duper cute it has like a lot of patches on it got some overalls with a little Christmas sweater um, another full body sweatshirt which I'm not really sure where I got this from but I think it might have been part of like some type of pack like I said I love these like full length sweatshirts they're easy to like pop on throw some accessories leggings shoes whatever and really turn them into a full-blown outfit this I think is a similar version of this the plain overalls except it's a skirt now I would love this but without Mimi, like the, the the pattern for Christmas, we also have like some jailbird. I swear these ones look like jailbird. Like like literally, she just came out of the, pen the penitentiary. But these are the most adorable little like onesies I have ever seen. We need so many onesies. We're gonna have a lot of kids, you know. I'm trying to keep it like fresh and you know new. And I really do want my kids to to be wearing some cute outfits until I can't handle it anymore. So these actually match too, if you wanted. Grabbed a couple bathing suits too, of course. We've got all different variants there. I have um, this outfit, which I think is absolutely adorable. It basically is from the toddler stuff pack, I think, but it's just a bunch of like re colors involved. So if you wanted to kind of like brighten up your, your options, you totally have like way more to choose from. Um, I think this is a dress that we also get from the toddler stuff and it comes in like the little cupcake, you know, just very limited swatches. But this one, again, kind of makes your options a little more vast. And then, of course, the last outfit we have is this little bunny hoodie, which, again, could totally be interpreted as they're borrowing it from their older sister or brother. You know what I mean? Like, things like that. I think it's so cute. And it also adds a little taste, a little flair of uh, realism. So I grabbed a couple of these little tops here. We've got pineapples. We've got watermelons. Cool thing about these is that they actually come with interchangeable, um, un like, not underwear, but, like, you know, like, I guess, I don't know, diapers, supposedly. So if you wanted, you could make like a little, you see what I'm saying? Like you could make this like a little swim outfit. I think it's cute. It's so cute. And we also have this raincoat here, which I love. Oh my gosh. And it comes in solids too. Pair that with a cute pair of freaking jeans and your sim is good to go. Also, if you wanted, uh, you could throw on some wellies. You could do some converse here. And if you really were feeling super duper fancy, again, the socks, they add everything. It's all about the details, friends. It's all about the details. So I really loved that jacket. I also have like a little crop too. So I would love it to do that maybe like for a swim outfit or something, or you could like throw on little shorts or I don't know, you can play around, but I just, I feel like it's cropped weird. So I would probably like use it as like a bathing suit top or something. Uh, we also have a couple graphic tees, which are circus themed. I thought those were kind of fun and cute. I always loved the circus as a kid and I'm pretty positive this it might be like a base game shirt but again a bunch of different swatches and variants one thing I did notice about shopping for toddlers is a lot of the stuff isn't really new it's just like recolors of stuff so that was kind of frustrating a couple of the items of course I did find were really cute in the fact that they were brand new um the only thing I don't like about these jeans here I love these jeans don't get it wrong but uh you will notice a little bit of clipping it is actually meant to be worn with this top in particular that kind of like tucks in which is so cute it is this seriously most blah 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 I can't even talk cute to Sam outfit I've ever seen but unfortunately um when worn with that shirt you will see like a little clipping now it does look good here with this top so you have a couple other options um and what to wear it with but then you have this problem in the back so it, you're gonna have to play around a little bit and see what works for you but I really love those jeans oh my god it's so sad I love those jeans so again going back to what I was showing you earlier I grabbed a pair of jeans we got some diaper changing colors <laughs> uh some floral some floral pants are kind of low these are super low and then we've got some more just like basic shorts that can be worn for either um swimming you could wear these uh, out and about we've got some skirt recolors or just skirts some of the uh, pajama bottoms for the circus set another pair of skinny jeans and then my favorite pair of like actual jeans 
these ones here, which is unfortunate because again, they don't really like work out too well. But all right, I think that's about it. I did get a couple, like I said, I got like an undershirt too. So you, if you want this adds even more customizability to your outfits, I think one comes in like a turtleneck. You can go and just have at it. Like there's so many different lengths of sleeve, colors, prints, all that fun stuff. This just really takes your outfits to the new, like the next level, gives them another spin. We've got some really fun little leggings here. We got some glitter ones, the socks. I've been like raving about this entire freaking time. And then I have another pair that have like little lace, which I think would be so cute for like the fall and winter months. And of course, we've got our little, our little knee highs, which I think that pretty much concludes everything except for like the, I got these slippers. I think I needed them for something. I wasn't sure what I needed them for. But I'm pretty positive you've seen these like a million times. Um, they just come in a bunch of different colors. I got wellies, which is a staple. You need those different color to Mary Jeans, more colors of the Converse. And then last but not least, I have um, some cowboy boots, which I also think are absolutely freaking adorable. Now, I'm not sure if I did download any custom teeth. Oh, I did. Okay. So the only teeth that I have that are custom are just basically gums. Like it's literally called gumming it. <laughs> and um, I'm like, okay, all right, I see you. So if you wanted to, you know, you saw this, did not have any dentists, which is actually good for other things like um when you're posing them to be babies and stuff that is like definitely a necessity because like little infants like newborns don't have gums then you probably would want that but i don't know i just thought why the hell not so i'm only gonna go through the hairs that i feel like fit you know or were made uh for males granted of course these could be for females males whatever i'm just going through the things that or like unique to them, I guess. Um, and so I feel like the only one that really I downloaded that was specifically for the males, I have like three here. This hair, I'm pretty positive I've showcased once before, but I love it so much. Even if it isn't realistic, I think it's absolutely adorable. I love this hair and I love that you can like customize the bandana. And what else do I have? I've got this one, which I also think is really flattering and super cute. We've also got this hair, which is basically a conversion from a stranger. I've also got the Ivy Roots hair, which I'm pretty sure I might actually already have in my collection. Um, but I have this one, which was actually the hair Grayson wore for a majority of his teenage hood, which is very interesting. Kind of takes me back a little bit. And then this one, too, I feel like is perfect for males. Like, I feel like you could really like even these like these could. It doesn't matter, you know, but I'm just trying to save time and I'm trying just to go through the things that I know were meant specifically for the boys in general. OK, so I'm pretty sure covered everything there. I'm going to go and give him this hair just so we can see things. Um, I don't think there's anything proprietary here. Maybe like the, the little, I guess, shirts that are for um, the males, the boys in general. And then for the pants, I do actually have a couple pairs. I know I don't actually. I think all the pairs I showed you earlier are exactly the same for the boys. Now, these are great for both genders, but it's unfortunate because they clip into so many things. But honestly, I don't know if that would bother me. I like them so much that it may just have to be that way, to be honest. And I do have the other like toddler stuff on my Tumblr if you guys are interested in giving it a look. But other than the things that I've showed you, oh, I have two more things. Okay, so I've got this outfit here, which is a full body Kind of, I think this is a conversion, um, but it has like suspenders and stuff. And I think this is so cute. There's like a couple solids. We've got some really fun uh, patterns in there. And then I think this one, no, I've already shown you this too, but this is what it looks like on the boys as well. I think it's absolutely freaking precious. It's absolutely adorable. I love it to that. Okay, so moving on to Z children. You forgot about them, didn't you? Oh my God, you guys, I'm telling you. Oh, also side note. Oh my goodness gracious. So you're probably like, wow, your toddler has some really good brows. I know. Thanks. But <laughs> I went and downloaded the adult eyebrows, like base game eyebrows conversion uh, for the toddlers, which will be like freaking front and center on my tumblr you guys need these you need these because these eyebrows ugh, like not even these ones where are they these ones like what is this like what in the freaking crayola crayon happened here like i want to know these eyebrows are atrocious like nobody has eyebrows that look like freaking little like you know what i mean it's yarn it looks like yarn like it's no we need these so yeah if you want them they're gonna be on my tumblr too i had them a while back but then when i decided to give myself a cc cleanse which lord knows i need now um 
I took them out and I never put them back, but I regretted it. I regretted it ever since. Now, I really like this creator and I love their styles. We've got this hairstyle here, which I might have maybe possibly showcased once before, but it's by Peachy Bloom. I have a lot of hairs by Peachy Bloom and I'm going to be honest, there is someone that creates hairs that I think it's called Sultry. Um, their, their like Tumblr is deactivated for whatever reason and I'm telling you, they make the best, the best children's hairs. I have ever seen so you know just to stop your girl from crying and breaking out in tears if you guys have a link to them if like they're still creating let me know because some of their um, creations I wasn't able to get because of the sole fact that they were deactivated so here are a bunch of their creations you're gonna see like 50% of the hairs that I have showcased today are from them I just think they're wonderful and they're really unique and super duper beautiful very excited about all of these hairs they look amazing I noticed I downloaded a lot of like these wavy hairs which is kind of unfortunate I definitely need um, a lot more like textured hair I need a lot of textured hairs because I just feel like I only have like a couple like I don't have very many like a few possibly but not a vast amount now I will say I've got a bunch of amazing textured hairs in my adult CC shopping haul coming in four days so if you guys are looking for some there I definitely have you covered but this hair I don't know who it's by um, but I really liked this one I felt like it was super duper unique so I grabbed a bunch of like scouting recolors I don't know what it is but I'm kind of like high key fat infatuated with scouts in the Sims so I did go and grab um, a I think it's a full body outfit of that so you can go and have your sims where it doesn't need to be unlocked or anything i don't know i think it's really cute i love it it just reminds me of finley so much i love it to death got some overalls up in here with different color prints and stuff i just love how cash it's like so casual i really like that we also have um a full body an outfit that comes like with a belt we've got like cropped jeans this is apparently um a pair of overalls which is kind of nice we also have a bunch of like sweatshirts and stuff here uh, we've got cable knit crew turtle all sorts of animals i guess and then i don't know what this is but it kind of looks like it is high key like alpha <laughs> yeah, i don't know i've got a bunch of these basic just t-shirts that are recolor some cats and dogs i've got another recolor of the bomber jacket from seasons this belongs to that and to be honest it's a little too high alpha for me um, i don't think i'll be keeping it in my game but if you do love alpha it's actually a really nice piece another just basic basic t-shirt with a long sleeve underneath a hoodie that has a bunch of like the sims icons i love the balloon though like the animal balloon or the balloon dog that's actually isn't that a part of a famous something or other I, i'm pretty sure i saw it in the kardashians something goons or something i don't know anyway long story short <laughs> moving on we also have a conversion which i actually love a lot and i have pants that go with it perfectly graded i mean it's a little it's a little rough around the edges but i love what it could be um so play around with it a little bit but i feel like there are definitely pants out there that will fit kind of like the more cropped look now this blazer oh my god with the pants that you guys just saw creates such an amazing outfit like i feel like this is the perfect kind of like bougie formal wear like maybe your sim is just you know i don't know why but this gives me like rich boy vibes it really does i don't know what it is but it, it looks great and there's a bunch of other recolors in here i mean there's not like a lot right but you definitely get a nice selection you have all of your necessities and i think it's just so clean like i wish all taller CC not taller but children CC was like this one um, I've got another kind of like cropped um, cropped t-shirt that goes great with these pants these pants are definitely a little rough around the edges I'm pretty sure it was supposed to go with this Okay, but look what happened here. Look what Jen did here. Okay, I don't know what my problem is, but usually I check the messages before I freaking start filming. But, you know, his the rest of his body went ghost. I apologize. But, uh, yeah, I'll definitely reblog it on my uh, Tumblr. And I'm, I'm pretty sure these are the pants that you would need for a lot of, like, these higher-waisted items. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but I really love these slacks. Like, they're actually my favorite. Granted, there's a little space in between here, but this top is seriously amazing. Like, I really love how intricate it looks. It's very, like, good quality. For the bottoms, I've got a pair of shorts with a belt, so I feel like you could dress these up, dress these down. I'm pretty positive these jeans would be absolutely amazing if Jen didn't forget the mesh, so you definitely needed those to go with the items. I 
kind of rise a little bit up on the waist. And then we have the formal slacks, which again, I mean, you could probably wear casually, dressed up, what have you. And of course, we've got these super high-rise bell-bottom pant. I also picked up this Animal Lover bracelet set. Now, it comes in four different swatches, and you can't really see it as I'm showing you in Create SM, but if you go on my Tumblr and you look at it, you can see it with much greater detail. And I also snagged these ankle socks, which I think are really cool, super useful for many occasions. And then also we have the thigh high or like knee high socks um, available for the children as well. For shoes, I just have my wellies that you guys have already seen on the toddlers. And then I also have a pair of cowboy boots that I think are converted from the base game, but I'm not 100% sure. So I'm pretty positive that is all for the boys and moving on to the girls. Okay, so we have a bunch of hairs. A lot of them are going to be super duper similar to the ones that you guys have already seen on my toddlers. This one here is really cool. It's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful braid, but it also comes with a accessory that you can go and change the elastic or you could also, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> like really though, you can change the elastic, I think, or no, it's just the bow so you can add a little add a little bow to it which I think is fun to like have it you know match like your outfits and it just adds a little extra flair to the hair um, we've got a bunch of ivy roots which is kind of fun too I really love these hairs most of them I think are like conversions from things I'm not a hundred percent sure if that is accurate or not, but I downloaded a lot. Like I have so many hairs now. I am very excited. Like I'm super excited. I downloaded all this stuff yesterday. I'm like, oh my God, all I want to do is go play the 100 baby now and just showcase the ish out of all this stuff because it's beautiful. Like they're so gorgeous. I love these hairs. I feel like these ones are very similar. Like one's a little more volumized than the other. Cool thing about the braided bobbles is that you can actually go and change your bobbles. So if you wanted them to match your outfit, you could do that um, but a lot of these hairs are gonna be super similar to the ones that you have seen for the toddlers so I'm gonna kind of like skim through pretty quickly on these I grabbed a bunch of like braided pigtails because they're like super duper easy these ones are also really adorable too they're like little milk braids I guess or what is it called is it called milk braids I have no idea it's probably not huh it's like milk it's milk braids right something I don't know so I also have a bunch of these hairs here again stemming from the toddlers. I really liked these a lot. This hair from Island uh, Island Living is honestly everything. I love it. It's really pretty. I also downloaded a bunch of hairs from, again, Peachy Bloom. I'm going to show you guys what they look like in kind of the more like mid-tone ranged colors. Now, obviously, a lot of these hairs are going to look different depending on what swatch you have. I feel like these hairs honestly could go either way. Like, you can do them in lighter swatches. You can do them in darker swatches. I'm just personally a fan of darker swatches. I know I get yelled at you guys, like, from you guys all the time. Like, Jed, dude, we can't see anything we can't see anything lighten it up so I'm so sorry like it's just a nasty habit I'm trying to fix it but I, I I'm not even kidding like I have so many hairs from peachy bloom it is crazy she makes the best the best hairs I love them this one also is a little interesting we've got something going on in the back and then a little bit on the front it's actually really cool I've never seen anybody make a hair like this before it's got a lot of different things going on I really love like the pieces in the front and just how it looks visually from the front now this hair here is very similar to the one that we saw in the toddlers I just need to go back and get that bow accessory because it is too cute not to have all right so I'm gonna just go and just skim on through the rest of these hairs because you guys have kind of seen them we saw that one early on the toddlers we also have some more of these braids I think these are like conversions from Strangerville Navia Sims also has a bunch of amazing, amazing hair. So you definitely should go and check out them. We've got a couple of um, the conversions. I know that this one is called Azor because it's like one of my favorite hairs, but this is a conversion as well. We've also got one from Sim Mandy. I really loved these chunky braids. Like I didn't get to talk about them too much earlier, but those are also really cool. And then we've got these pigtails, which are definitely one of my favorites, which is crazy because I think I downloaded them for the adults and I wasn't that crazy about it. But for the kids, like I'm absolutely in love. I also really love this hairstyle here. And the fun thing is you can go and change the color of the scrunchie. We've got this hair, which I've seen a lot. I've seen this hair so much and I've never downloaded it. And I don't know why. Like I have no idea why. So I'm super excited um, to get that one in my game. We have a couple other hairs from Sultry. This is another one and another one. 
And another one. Oh my God, they make the best hairs. I'm like so sad that they don't create. Like I think they don't anymore. I think they closed it down, but I'm not, I'm not 100% sure. So these last few are from Navy Sims. It's the same hair, just in a bunch of different amazing styles. So you guys can definitely have like a lot of options when playing around with their creations. And this one here is also really cute. And another one by Sultry. And the last one um, that you guys saw for the boys also looks amazing for the girls. I really like this hair a lot. Full body outfits are literally all the same from the uh, boys, except we do actually have like a couple of different variants. Now this outfit could be for boys or it could be for girls, but I think I actually like it on the females a little bit better, but that's just me. We also have this, uh, what is it called? Like a nightgown. Now I thought this would come in other colors, but the only thing that genuinely changes is just like the little, the little detail right there, which is okay. I think it's cute and I don't really have like a lot of, you know, sleepy time stuff for my kids. Like most of it, the majority of it, is primarily uh, like you know like pajama sets so that was kind of interesting I also really love this overall set this one here is really cool too it's very different um it, it, I think this is a conversion of some kind so you have like where you know you're supposed to have chesticles but obviously you don't because you're like I don't know 10 so <laughs> um, it was a little interesting that 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 was that that part was still there but other than that I think they're really cute and then we have a little romper which I also really really love a bunch now for the bottoms and the tops I've got a lot of the same stuff we have this cute little blouse with lace detailing now I'm gonna go and put on uh, pants for her so that we can or skirt I like the skirt a lot so that you can get a better idea of how this stuff looks I don't really think there's anything else up here but I do have some other outfits like this little hoodie it's a crop but it's really cute. I love it a lot, especially like the pink and stuff. It is so freaking adorable. Um, we have a pajama set, I believe. Now I can't really see because it's kind of light, but it's supposed to go with this bottom. And I really love that you can like switch it up and you can like make it match or make it different. So these are actually a really cute like set of pajamas. Then we have another cropped tee or a cropped shirt. Um, and I'm gonna go and put on a pair of jeans. I really liked those jeans, but of course they are missing the freaking bottoms. Oh my god. Okay, so this is what you need. This is what they look like, but you need to make sure you get the mesh for these, okay? By the web zipper. All right, so I can go and put on this little tracksuit, or I could actually just give her these jeans too. I really love those jeans. Oh my god. Yeah, these ones are too small, so you definitely want those. That's interesting. I felt like this came as a set. So for whatever reason, maybe I just didn't notice that. I don't know. But we have other types of like printed t-shirts and stuff that are kind of fun to wear. This one here, which is great for, again, wearing like with high rise jeans that have Simlish, which is really cool. Um, we've got this guy, which you saw earlier in the boys. We have the same um, blazer kind of thing, which is also really cool. I loved this one the set by onyx sims It um, basically is like it could be for like athletic wear or not, but I, I don't know I just I thought it was really cute. So it matches like that. It has like a little a little stripe on the side I don't know but I thought it was so adorable really fun because like I also don't have a lot of like workout attire at all For my children, so I feel like that was kind of perfect um, for that occasion And then I have that shirt that we saw earlier for the boys could be for the girls um, and then in terms of like bottoms and stuff, I do have this really fun skirt, which I'm not sure where this came from, but I'm, I'm pretty sure this is like some sort of conversion or something. I'm not really sure, but I really liked that a lot. Uh, we also have a pair of um, joggers, which is great for the top that I showed you guys earlier from Onyx Sims. Comes in a bunch of colors as well. We have these fancy dancy slacks. Uh, another pair of jeans that only come in white subsequently, which is weird, but also um, there's recolors for if you wanted to have more options there. And then, of course, what you guys saw earlier, the high rise bell bottoms and accessories. Same old, same. Now, I do feel like the girls had a few other different accessories. Like, um, let me see here. We've got a pair of leggings, which are kind of nice. They're just solids. We've got the ruffled, uh, ruffled sock, which you guys also saw earlier they do match with this oh they look kind of stupid oh my god they look stupid <laughs> okay so maybe not wear them with the flats because honestly this looks like something Jen did when she was like five and my mom used to yell at me for her. so that kind of like gave me a little bit of a flashback but you know there are probably oh god oh my goodness gracious she looking like Mary Poppins in this bitch Anyway, probably wouldn't wear socks, but we do have socks. We've got the ankle socks. We've got the laced socks. Um, also, 
these ones here which are kind of knit and then we've got um thigh high which is kind of fun there's a bunch of different prints there knee high and then two-toned socks which actually have a band-aid attached which is kind of weird when you have leggings on so i'll take that off but oh my god ew there's like scrapes and stuff oh my goodness this is actually really cool for like storytelling but i didn't realize they were attached to a pair of socks and i got them and that scab looks gnarly it's actually making my stomach quench but yeah there's that okay cool and the single old wellies and cowboy boots now i want to go and share with you guys one one last thing, um, and that is dientes. I did download a bunch of teeth, but I'm pretty sure I might have showcased these before. I'm not really sure, but we have, you know, like some 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 crooked teeth. We've also got teeth with uh, braces and teeth without braces. A gap, like a mild gap, and then a mild gap with braces. So if you guys want to add more detail to your Sims' dientes, there are some options available there as well. Okay, so that pretty much is it for my CC shopping haul when it comes to the children. Of course, as I mentioned earlier, everything that I mentioned here today will be reblogged on my Tumblr at Jen2606. If in the event it is not up today, it will be up in at least four days because some of these items are mixed in with those other items that I'm gonna be showcasing in a couple days and it's just super hard to like go through all those items, you know? So if it's not up now, it will be up in a couple days and of course I will go ahead and even link where I got this stuff from so that you don't have to wait for me if you don't want to but anyway i'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video here i hope that you all enjoyed and if you did you know what to do with boo don't forget to go ahead and comment rate, and subscribe let me know what you guys think in the comments down below when the sun does not shine and i will see you all next time bye guys